warahmatullahi barakatuh. Welcome to the Auto Show. As you can see, today we are in Volvo. Super excited. We are about to go on an expedition exclusively with Volvo. We'll be checking out all their cars and also seeing the beautiful scenery of Oman. Auto show. Your eyes do not deceive you. This is not Tariq Al Barwani, but Maya Al Said. Today we are on a special expedition with Volvo. So Volvo and I go long way back. This was the first car that I bought when I was just 18 years old. And one of the reasons why I actually chose Volvo is because of my mother, who wanted me to have the safest car. So Volvo was our choice. And let me add to that comfort. I drove the XC90 today and it was a dream to drive. I could have driven for hours. So I had safety and comfort. What more could I ask for? To tell us more about the cars and really get nitty gritty, we have the Volvo brand manager, Mr. Talal al -Siyabi. Mr. Talal, why are we here today? Uh, as you know, uh, we used to drive uh, these cars uh, in the city. So today we we thought to come uh, here to Belitsi, Jabal Hat, and to drive uh, these cars here uh, off-road a little bit, and uh, to experience also the road and the mountains. Here we'll start with the new, uh, all new S60 which uh, launched a uh, couple of months ago. Uh, the car comes uh, with full option. We have uh, T4 engine in our market and uh, we can have it uh, T5 engine in special order. And here we have the S90 and we have it in two variants, the inscription and R design. Uh, the 250 horsepower T5 engine and we can have it in T6 uh, turbo and uh, supercharged. Uh, 320 horsepower uh, if you want the comfort and uh, the luxury drive the s90 then we have the three uh, suvs uh, models we have the small suv the xc40 with 190 horsepower again we have it in two models uh, uh, inscription and our design. Uh, the XC60, the mid-size uh, SUV, we have it again in our design, an inscription model with 254 horsepower. And the family car, the XC90, seven-seater, turbo supercharged engine, T6 with 320 horsepower. Hello, so we are here at Bilat Sit in Nizwa. We had an amazing experience last night. Uh, we stayed in uh, with the range of Volvo cars and uh, some of the Volvo fans here. So I'll introduce you to them, who had uh, an amazing experience, I think, driving the Volvo. So how was the experience, guys, uh, driving it yesterday from Muscat to Nizwa and staying overnight, the whole experience of Volvo expedition? Yeah, as everyone knows, Volvo is an amazing vehicle. Yesterday we drove, uh, I drove uh, Volvo XC40. It was a great vehicle, great comfort, 
and good response and uh, the safety features especially is great. How was your experience? I think you were you were driving XC40. We were driving uh, XC40, and uh, uh, the vehicle is amazing, and uh, the, especially the engine response and the safety features were uh, amazing. It was amazing, and uh, we came here uh, around 11:30 uh, uh, yesterday, the last day, and the last day uh, is one of our favorite uh, uh, picnic spot and that's why we choose uh, Bilad Seed uh, for this touring. It's an amazing place and uh, the weather was good, very good. The temperature was around 7-8 degrees yesterday and we had a great time yesterday, especially with Volvo. In fact, uh, just recently we featured at the Arabian Stories uh, the beautiful Bilad Seed in Nizwa. Uh, so we thought this is a perfect place for Volvo to actually come and explore the expedition. Uh, moving forward, we have two more guests. Uh, how was the experience guys last night? It was 8 degrees. How was it? It was pretty cold. Um, it was very windy uh, when we came here, but it was uh, we could manage it. But uh, towards the end, it got really, really uh, you know cold, but we had all uh, the facilities here provided by Volvo. And then we had a great time. We had a great campfire and the food uh, was prepared by one of the teammates of Volvo. Mr. Talal, and I think he's here right here, we will come back to him. Special thanks to Talal. Yeah, special thanks to him. And then we had a great time. We enjoyed a good amount of time here. Especially, I was driving the uh, XC60, uh, and uh, I was surprisingly um, impressed by its off-roading capabilities. And the features like 360 degree camera, so even the tight spots we were able to, you know, um, get it get down here very easily so it was an amazing experience overall